more authentic this way. Wait, do you want me to start? No, I'll start. We're good? Yep. All right, hello. Welcome to ESACS 2019. I'm here with Jared Goldsmith, the founder of ESACS. Hi, everybody. Hi, thanks, Ben. Thanks for having me today. Yeah. Welcome. Cheers. Thanks. So tell us a little bit about ESACS. Well, ESACS is a networking trade show <laughs> for small business owners, startups, people thinking of starting up a business but don't really know where to go yet. And it's also for those who are more established in entrepreneurship to meet other people, to find clients, to find jobs, to find other resources to help their businesses. Right. So that's what ESACS is all about. Amazing. And how long have you been uh, organizing this event? Uh, ESACS started in 2012, early 2012, as a very small event. We only had maybe 25, 30 people at the first one. Then three months later, we had maybe 30, 40 people. Three months later, we had maybe 40, 50 people. And then I think it was uh, October 2013, we changed the venue and we had 280 people. And that's when I realized it could really turn into something much larger to help the entrepreneur community here in town. That's amazing. At, at the time, I don't know if you knew, but there were five different chambers of commerce in Ottawa, just the Ottawa region. And as a musician, I joined all of them. And it was very expensive, very time consuming to go to all these events. And I realized that entrepreneurs might be part of one chamber, if any. And to realize the value of getting involved in the community, you got to get involved. And ESACS originally started as a way to bring together all of these chambers of commerce. And over the years, a few of the chambers, uh, boards of trade have merged. And as of this summer of 2018, there's only one big happy chamber now in Ottawa. It's called the Ottawa Board of Trade. They, they always exhibit here at ESACS. And it's a great opportunity to meet lots of other entrepreneurs. Amazing. So Jared was telling me the other day that he started his entrepreneurial journey in a band, That's right? right? Um, you had a sax band, uh, it was like a jazz band, right? They're called Sax Appeal. Right there, he's right? doing Sax Appeal. That's right. So Esax started out as a jazz band and through his journey started to collaborate with multiple entrepreneurs, different organizations, and it's grown immensely into what it is now. What, your last event, how many participants? Came? We had over 600 people at the last event. Over 600 entrepreneurs in this venue right here. That's right. Which is amazing. And we do it, what, every three? Every three months every... we do a big event. And one of the, the nice parts of ESACS is my band always performs. I don't know if you can see, but they're going to be starting up in a few minutes. Sax appeal. Maybe if we, if we keep going with the interview, you'll yeah. hear some, uh, so, some sax music. So the cool thing about what we're doing right now is we're using Instagram or Facebook Live. So how many people do we have on Instagram Facebook Live right now? We have one person. Hello? Hi. <laughs> yeah, so welcome. So uh, ESAX begins at 5 o'clock. So um, come on down, visit us. Can they buy their tickets still? Yeah, tickets are available at the door. Tickets are available at the door. Um, so come on down, do some networking, and get to know uh, the multiple entrepreneurs in, uh, in Ottawa. Perfect. And, and it's, it's 5 to 10 p.m. The venue is the Horticulture Building at Lansdowne Park, uh, 1015 Bank Street at TD Place. Amazing, yeah. And we'll be doing more Facebook Lives throughout the night. So uh, keep in touch and, uh, and follow us. And uh, what are our social media? Uh, ESAC's networking. You should be able to find us pretty easily on all social media. Amazing. Perfect. Thank you very much. Thanks, Jared. Ben. Happy networking, everybody. Thanks, Ben. See ya.